We are going to demonstrate how to bottom water your house plants using a humidity tray. Bottom watering is a method of watering your plants from the bottom up. When you place your plant into a container of water, the water is pulled up through the bottom drainage hole by the plant. This technique is used as an alternative to watering from the top. To get started, you're going to select your plant of choice. We are using an avocado seedling that's planted in a four inch diameter plant pot. If you're going to bottom water, your plant pot must have a drainage hole. Next, you're gonna select your tray or bowl you're gonna use to bottom water. It doesn't need to be very deep, but the size should be wider in diameter than your plant pot. You should also note not to use a terracotta tray or bowl as it's gonna absorb the water and leak onto your countertop or surface. So it's best to use a non-porous tray material. Now you're gonna add your clean pebbles in a thin layer to the bottom of your tray and spread out evenly. I do have a much more detailed video on how to create humidity trays that I'm going to link above. So for now, we're gonna move forward with our completed humidity tray and add your plant to the center of the tray. If your plant pot includes a saucer, you can go ahead and set the saucer to the side and then make sure that the exposed drainage hole is on top of the humidity tray. And if you haven't checked already, before you begin bottom watering, you wanna check the moisture of your plant soil. You can either use a moisture meter such as the Susti or you can just check with your finger or a chopstick. The soil should be dry a few inches below the topsoil if you need to actually water your plant. So once you've confirmed that it is in fact dry, you can go ahead and add water to your, hum your humidity tray so that the water level is above the top of the rocks and reaching the bottom of your plant. An alternative option is you could water from the top of your plant and let the excess water fill the tray below and then that way the plant will also still absorb water from the bottom. You're gonna to wanna to let your plant sit for about five to 10 minutes and check the soil moisture level again. If it's still dry a few inches below the soil, you're gonna repeat the process. If your plant is now hydrated, you wanna make sure that your humidity tray water level is now below the top of the rocks. If it's above the rocks, it's still gonna be sitting and absorbing excess water, which could lead to overwatering. So if it's still too high, remove any excess water from your tray. There are a lot of benefits to bottom watering versus top watering. Number one is that it's really great for rehydrating plants that are really dried out or dehydrated. When you top water, your water is just gonna flow out the bottom and it's not likely that the plant is actually gonna absorb much of the water. Bottom watering is a slower method, so it allows the plant roots to absorb the water. Another benefit is that bottom watering is more consistent. Bottom watering also prevents excess water on plant foliage. This is really helpful for plants that are sensitive to water on their leaves, such as violets or date palms. Uh, this is also just helpful for preventing pools of water on any plants that could lead to fungus growing. Bottom watering can reduce pests. If you are ensuring the soil is just staying moist, below the top soil line, you are preventing a breeding ground for fungus gnats. And lastly, one of my favorite benefits is that bottom watering is less messy. Typically when you top water, you have a high chance of water overflowing when the water goes through the drainage hole. Bottom watering will never overflow. And then your added benefit of using a humidity tray for bottom watering is that it's gonna create a humid microclimate for your plants. A humidity tray will increase humidity levels slightly around the plant placed on top of the tray. And as always, if you need to significantly increase humidity levels for a room or space, I recommend getting a humidifier. Thank you for watching. Please leave any questions below in the comments and please like and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this.